In the early Christian church, Holy Saturday was a day of mixed emotions, as it marked the end of the season of Lent and penance and the beginning of the joyful Paschal time. This day had various names such as Great Saturday, Holy Saturday, the Angelic Night, and the Vigil of Easter. Fasting was observed strictly during this time, with the breaking of the fast occurring at dawn on Sunday. The night of the Easter Vigil was originally filled with ceremonies throughout the entire night, but over time these ceremonies were moved to Saturday morning. This change allowed for special services to be assigned to Holy Saturday. Welcome to SD Kaysen Courses. Today's topic is Holy Saturday in the Early Christian Church. The early Holy Saturday celebrations included the blessing of the new fire, the lighting of lamps and candles, and the Paschal candle, symbolizing the light of the risen Christ. The faithful would gather to pray, sing psalms and hymns, and listen to the readings of the scriptures. This vigil was also dedicated to the baptism of catechumens, as it was one of the only days when baptism was administered. However, as the number of catechumens grew, the clergy struggled to maintain order, leading to the anticipation of ceremonies to occur during daylight hours. In conclusion, Holy Saturday in the early Christian church was a day of both joy and sadness, as it marked the end of Lent and the beginning of the Paschal season. It was a day of fasting, prayer, and the baptism of new believers. This celebration teaches us the importance of embracing both the sorrowful and joyful moments in our lives, as they are often intermingled and help shape our faith and spiritual journey. And that was Holy Saturday in the early Christian church in a nutshell. Thanks for learning with us. Until next time, may God bless you forever and ever.